Digital host Phil Panarski joins us now with a look at what's trending online today. And Phil, we have to talk about the latest Target 8 investigation. That's right. Ken Kolker and Carter Gent brought us the story of Kathy Swartz, who was murdered back in 1988. The full investigation from Target 8 looks at the last 35 years since that fateful December day in Three Rivers. Find out more on the initial search for a suspect, the dead ends, the new technology used in the case, and of course, who Kathy was before her untimely death. It's all on our website right now. And next, digital reporter Matt Jarowski took us back even further in our state's history this weekend with his latest Sunday story that looks at Michigan's first ever election. It took place 225 years ago yesterday and was key in establishing what was then known as the Northwest Territory as what we call the Wolverine State today. You can get a bit of a history lesson by checking out the story on woodtv.com. And wrapping things up today, the National Bobblehead Hall of Fame and Museum unveiled a great gift for the holidays. If you love Michigan State basketball, the team is celebrating 125 years, and so the museum has unveiled a set of five bobbleheads, two of legendary coaches Judd Heathcote and Tom Izzo, and of course, you have to have one of Sparty. They're on sale now and can be purchased by heading over to our website, woodtv.com. And these bobbleheads could not have come at a better time. Michigan State was kind of reeling to start the year, yep. but they got a pretty big win uh, over the weekend against Baylor. Phil, I uh, enjoy and appreciate your reports, but here's just a, a cautionary note. When you bring out five bobbleheads and she's sitting here <laughs> and they're all from Michigan State, right. I'm a little concerned about what the reaction might be. Yeah. She was on her phone. Right, all right. Where can I buy them? Where can right, I right. find them all on a website right now? Yeah. yeah. All right. Thank Thanks, you, Phil. Phil.